Ah, oh, balls! You... Oh my god! Okay, fine. Wasn't that hard? Yeah, hit the wall, bitch. Stretch out. Stretch out. Okay. Here we go. Oh my god. Okay. Now. Okay. Here we go. Here we go. Did it. Okay, good. Let's keep going. Daisy, shut your fucking trap! Bitch. I'm gonna enjoy this. Fucking great. Oh no. Ugh. It's complete total bullshit. Okay, here we go. Okay. I'm guessing jump up there. Oh yeah, dudes. Uh, I went to E3. Um, I don't know if you saw those videos, but that shit was sick. Um, uh, as as you saw, I don't know if you saw them, but if you saw, uh, I got a a friend who knew somebody who hooked it up pretty nice we got him for free um we went dude it was so sick as soon as you go in it's like an overload of gaming is fucking ridiculous it's like uh uh you go in and and it's like bam right in your face right like right to the kisser and you don't know what the fuck to do it like takes you off guard like, oh my god it's like it's fucking ridiculous dude you go in, there's like nine places where you can go play right in front of your face. You don't know where to start. I was going nuts. I was like, oh, oh. I was going in circles for about two minutes. And then I finally decided to go left. And I started from the left all the way to the right. And the place I started was like where the Ataris were at. So I guess from I went from like least technological 
to the, like the most technological because I wound up where um, they had a 3D uh, uh, three screen. Oh fuck! Did I miss it? God damn it! That's fucking terrible. Oh balls! Oh shit! Let's push it again. Push. Makes it come down. Anyways, so I started from the left playing with the Ataris and shit. And then uh, I scooted all the way over to the right and it started getting more technological. It was pretty crazy. And then more technological. And then by like, the time I got to all the way to the right, I was uh, where they had a, like a, I don't know if you saw in the video, they had like these briefcase. This gaming briefcase where you literally just roll around with like headphones and all kinds of shit and the briefcase is fucking awesome, dude. No! Fuck! All that for nothing. Anyways, that briefcase was pretty insane. I mean, I wouldn't buy it because it's probably expensive than shit, but you know. That shit is sick. Um... And then I played on the, on, I played some driving games, like, I fucking love driving games, dude, this shits are sick. <clears throat> I played Dirt 3 like nine times while I was there, it's fucking ridiculous. I played on, uh, by control, and I played with a normal, like, little steering wheel. And after that I played on, a, on a, one of those gaming seats. And then after that I played on a gaming seat that moves. The moving gaming seat, dude, that shit was so bomb. And, uh, all the way at the end of the, you know, the, like, the convention center, they had the fucking, uh, the, where they sold the, the gaming seats, and I got, I, I sat on the wall with, like, surround sound and all kinds of shit. Dude, that thing was sweet. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Oh, balls. Oh, balls. Where the fuck am I supposed to go? Oh, balls. We're, oh, shit. Oh, God. This is not safe. MLG Pro, son. Button! Anyway, so I played with some pretty technological shit. I was kind of, um... Look, Jackknife may know something about Pope um, so don't let him wind you up, okay? He used to be a pretty decent runner. I was kind of wondering, uh, now. uh, like, like, I was wondering, like, whether I should be online for that MW3, like, I thought they were going to play. But then it turns out, <laughs> it turns out that line for, was a 10-minute video that you could actually view on YouTube. <laughs> so that was the biggest waste of time I've ever heard of in my life. Um, that was total jip. So I'm like, good, good thing I didn't fucking make line for that, so, <laughs> And then uh, people were like, um, they're making line to play, uh, God, where the, Hello, face. who the fuck is this guy? I'm gonna chase him. Oh, jeez. Fuck you, dude. <laughs> Anyways, uh, fuck. I played, um, Blood Island. Dude, that thing is fucking awesome. Oh, shit. Fuck. I played Blood Island. That shit was awesome. I, I was going to record it and be like, oh, I'm going to put this shit on the channel. But but they're like, oh, you can't, you actually can't record it because it's not out yet. And we don't want people, like, uh, you know, giving out what it looks like and how it plays. Because I guess that part of E3 was, like, only for, like, vendors and shit. So unless you had money to offer, you couldn't really record it. I was like, oh, that's fucking whack, son. And so then it let me record it, so I was like, whatever, you know. Fuck! And then, uh, I wanted, I wanted to play, like, uh, Arkham City. Like, the new Batman and shit. But it turns out, um... The line was too fucking long and out. There's no way I was waiting those four hours to play about five minutes of the game. I'm fucking straight. Whoa.
fuck. And then everybody was making lines to play Forza Motorsports 4 on one of those gaming chairs. <laughs> the fucking idiots. They waited a three hour line to sit on a gaming chair and play Forza 4. I literally went to the other side of the convention center and found the exact same thing for, with no line. It was fucking awesome. Dude, where the fuck do I go? It was fucking great. Am I even going the right way? Fuck, dude. Gears of War 3, I played that. That shit is pretty awesome. There was a fat ass line for that too, and then uh, I kind of snuck in because uh, some guy was. I was near the like the end where they let you out of playing the Gears of War thing, like where the exit is, because you have to make line to get behind this. Fuck you, smug bastard. Anyways, um, yeah, dude, I went near the exit, and the people were all, they were all just lining up during the entrance, you know, and the entrance was like two-hour line to play Gears of War, and I just went near the exit, and I was just looking at some guy play play it, and it, and it looked pretty sick, I mean, Gears of War is always a sick-ass game, but the third one looks fucking smooth, it looks nice. Oh my god, you gotta be shitting me, am I gonna have to... My, oh fuck! You kidding me? Oh balls! Anyway, so I, I got near the exit of Gears of War 3. And some guy stopped playing, <laughs> and he was kind of wearing the almost the same thing I was, sort of. And uh, so I just got right next to him, and I, I just started looking at the screen. And eventually, when he left, I just picked up the remote like nothing happened. And I guess no one, either they saw and didn't say anything, or. I don't know, but I got to play. I got to play without line. That shit was sick. And, um... Fuck. Yeah, the game was sick, dude. But the one game I guaranteed am buying and playing and doing a motherfucking playthrough, motherfucker, is, uh, Driver. Driver, dude. I don't know if you saw in the video, I was talking to that designer. Dude, that shit is fucking awesome. Like, awesome times Trey. Fuck, fuck that. You can get out of the fucking map, like wander around, pick your car, all that jazz. Fuck! Oh my god. Oh my god. Yeah, dudes, I'm gonna fucking get driver. That shit was sick! I should start doing driving games. I'm fucking good at them. Oh, and there's this guy from Machinima there. Some dude from Machinima. And then, uh, he's playing Dirt. And he got, like, fourth place or some shit. That guy kind of sucked. And I played. And I was, I was so proud of myself, I got first place. I know what you're here for, Faithy. Just tell me what Icarus has to do with Pope's murder, Jack. I heard a cop did it. You heard wrong, then. You a fan of wrestling, Faith? Pope was a wrestling fan. He even employed an ex-wrestler to handle his security. Travis Burfield used to go by the name of Ropeburn. Is this going somewhere? Ropeburn? Well, he's really just a thug who got lucky. And sometimes people are too ignorant to see their place. Always want to swim in the big pond. Never see the bigger fish. If I were you, I'd start with a glorified slab of meat. Happy hunting, Faithy. Listen, I don't know about going to rope burn straight away. I'm not. I'm gonna see Miller. Why the fuck was he okay, running what are you then? Doing? You're gonna tell him about Jackknife? Not yet. He's still a cop. No matter what Kate says. That's fucking stupid. If you just gonna tell me that, why the fuck did he start running? 